sorry about that. <laughs> the um, the tape had went out. Um, I had taped um, before that. I had taped so much of the screening and all that stuff that I have to send to Bay. So um, a lot of that was still on the camera. So um, now I have to. So I just uploaded that onto my laptop, and so now to free up some room so I can get finished. But I really got to get going because I got to pick Tioni up in about 30, 40 minutes. Um, also, okay, first, 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 okay. So, I went to Windsor. So, this is just, uh, um, part two to, um, my, um, shopping haul. So, basically, I guess that's what we call this. We hauling and talking, I guess. Um, so I went to Windsor. I went to Closet. Closet is the shit, too. Oh, my God. I went to Closet. I went to Dee Dee's, and I went to Charlotte Root. Uh, let's go with Charlotte Root. I went to Charlotte Root because on some of my jumpsuits, um, I don't um, particularly want to wear a bra. Now, my breasts have been lifted. I've had a breast lift uh, a couple years back. So they just sit up this way. They don't rest on my rib cage or anything like that. They just sit up like this. But they're heavy, of course. I mean, and they're huge still. They just don't, you know, they're not, you know, just sitting on my stomach and resting on my rib cage and stuff. But, you know, so um, I was wondering if I could try this and see if it would work for me. So I don't know if any of you girls have this silicone bra. But I got me one, and the young lady told me that I needed to go down a size, which was cool anyway, because this is a D cup, and I'll clearly wear an F, F plus. <laughs> so, um, uh, so she said, go down one cup smaller than what you wear. So I wear an F, so um, I got a D. So we're going to see how it works on um, some of the jumpsuits and things that I got. We're going to try it out. We ain't trying it out tomorrow because, you know, it's going to be in the daytime and, you know, people are really looking at you up close. You know what I mean? Watching your everything. So, you know, I know that I have to be all the way together because, you know, people be looking at you and they looking at everything. They looking at your feet. They looking at your hairline. They looking at your neck. They looking at everything. When people meet you actually, in per when people we meet me, let me say, let me talk about me, okay? When people meet me in person, the first thing that I get is my teeth, my smile, and my height. And um, people just trips off that. I don't know, for whatever reason, people just be like tripping, like, oh my God, I can't believe how short you are. Or, you know, damn, you thick as hell. You know, you're not as big as you, you know, say that or think that you are or whatever. I don't know. So anyway... <clears throat> But um, I'm going to try this. I'm going to see how it works for me. If it don't work and it's a wrap, then therefore it's just something that I tried and it didn't do what I needed to do. No problem. I only paid $14.99 for it, so fuck it. If it don't work, it don't work. Um, but that's the only thing that I got from Charlotte Rue. But I like Charlotte Rue too. But at the closet, now mind you, it's all wrinkled up and stuff because I need to hang my stuff up. I need to hang this shit up. And I haven't. I've been having it all sitting over there on my um, liberator. But anyway, I had got me another little shrug, and this is more of that olive color. I love the olive uh, color, and this matches perfectly to my cat suit that I had on um, when I went to my girl's party for a hubby, um, and I paid $17.99 for this, and oh my God, I love it. Oh my God, and it got a little belt to it. It has the, um, the collar that kind of ruffles down. You know, to give you some shape. So, I love that. So, I got that from there. Did I get this from Windsor? No, I got this from Closet. And this is just simply a white top that I could wear with my jeans. What I was saying, though, before the camera went off, I went to BB. And at BB, I wear uh, 28s. So, um, the pants and stuff that I was trying on and the overalls and everything, I wear BB, uh, size 28 at BB. So, I just kind of let you know where I'm at with things. But anyway, I bought this white top, and it was $5.99 at the closet. But look at the back. Isn't that cute? And it was on clearance, too, for $5.99. I bought a size small. It fits me bomb. No problem. 
Um, I also got this from the closet. And this is just simply a little bodysuit. But I also love this rose color. I love, love, love this rose color. Is that not cute? Oh my God. And this was $7.99, regular price. Now, uh, what else? Is that the only thing? No, 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 no. Because no. I don't want to mix up the stores. Okay, now this is a jumpsuit I got at the closet. And this was $22.99. And oh my God, this fits me like a glove too. I mean, it's hugging every curve I got. I mean, it's, yeah, it's doing it like that. And this is a size small. So, yeah, it's hugging, but it got some stretch to it. But it fits me perfectly. I mean, it fits me really, really good. I'm just, I just have no midsection, no rolls on the back. And you know what I'm saying? And I have no, my waist is small. So, that's what allows me to be able to wear certain things that you be like, well, how's she going to put that on? And I, when I put it on it, you know what I'm saying? Because my midsection is small. But it's going to stretch around the booty and it's going to stretch around the hips. Whereas, you know, it's like, ain't nobody really tripping on that. You know what I mean? I got a little curve to it. But as long as it's hugging in the waist, if I wear something that's baggy in the waist, it makes me look much bigger. I have to wear something that's actually tailored fit. I have to wear something that actually fits. Because if I wear something big, like even with this big ass shirt on right here, it makes me look bigger because the shirt is so big and it's covering up everything else. But when it comes down to my waist, look at my waist. I mean, if you could see that, I mean, like, look. Like, look, you know, away from, you know, I mean, here's all the shirt. But, you know, when you actually looking at my waist part, look. You know what I mean? Look, look, look how my waist is. Can you see that? So, yeah. So, you know, I'm just little in the middle. Got much back. <clears throat> so, anyway, check this out, though. So, I don't know where I'm going to wear it. I'm probably going to go to dinner or whatever with Bay in this um, more than likely. Um, because I don't know where else I could wear it. The, where, the way it's hugging... It's hugging everything. And then it got this little peekaboo up in the front. Yeah, it's doing a whole lot, but it's bad as hell. Oh, yeah. That's one of them. I'm going to be able to get whatever I asked for that night from that ass, baby. Um, and I got this one, too. I also got this one from the closet. And this is a size medium. And this was on clearance for $13.99. And it's just another jumpsuit. You see, I had it on. And it also fits like a glove. And a lot of these, they all came with belts and stuff to them. But actually, I'm going I'm to take this and I'm going to make me a choker out of it. I'm going to just bend it and make me a choker out of that one or this one. Because this, no, this one, probably. Because it interchanges. It comes on and off. And then I can still, you know, I can bend it and make it to go around my neck. So that's, what, that's my plan. Because I doubt if I'm going to wear it um, too often with the jumpsuit that it came with, you know, so. And it came with this jumpsuit right here, as you can see the loops. <laughs> but I'm going to show you what it looks like. <clears throat> but it's, it's pretty cool. I, I like it. And for $13.99 on clearance, holla, you know what I mean? And I, I love my shrugs because um, it kind of, when you wear, especially if, for me, okay, I'm 45 years old, so I can't, just put on something that's really giving you all this Coke bottle figure eight and I don't kind of taper it down just a little bit. You know what I mean? I mean, of course, you're going to see what I'm working with. Like, tomorrow, I'm not going to wear no um, shrug or anything. So, you're going to see this bodysuit walking with these motherfucking pants on and I'm going to straight give body on Crenshaw tomorrow. But, however, I'm fully covered. Um, long sleeves, this, this, this. You know what I'm saying? You can't... If it's going to be clingy to you, you need to be covered up. So if if you're gonna if, if if it's gonna be tight or clinging, in which this is not tight, it's just clinging. But when something is clinging, you don't want nothing pouring out, pouring over, spilling out. You know what I'm saying? Now, my, of course, these girls is gonna be doing what they need to do, but I'm just not going to be like, you know, everything just out. No, everything will be covered, but you're just going to see body. And you're going to be like, what the hell? What? 
like, yeah, one of them. So, uh, anyway, but I like this one too because this one here is off the shoulders. It's like a little off the shoulder get down. Is that not cute? Oh my God. And I mean, it got a snug, a snag in it. And I guess that's why it was on clearance or whatever. But you know me, I'm going to try to figure out a way. But when I put a shrug on around it, you ain't going to be able to tell all that because I don't need you looking at my ass no way. You know what I mean? You'll be able to see all this right here, but you ain't, you know what I mean? I mean, I, I you know, I have a man in my life and I don't want to be, you know, and especially, you know, in a line of work that he does and what he do and all that kind of stuff, you know, I got to kind of be, you know, a little bit respectful. You know what I mean? Now, if it was just on some Tina stuff, then therefore, then let the good times roll. You know what I mean? But, you know. I'm just trying to, you know, cover it up just slightly. Um, and this one here, this one is also equally as cute. This is a, this is also a size small. This is $14.95. Um, and it is just another jumpsuit. And it also came with another one of those belts. <clears throat> and, um, yeah. But this one has like the ruching down the leg. Um, but look at the back. Check that out. So when I put on the wide belt and all that, and oh my God, it fits so beautifully. This fits so beautifully. It's a small though, but it, it look, it's small, but it doesn't seem as small. I don't know. It has pockets. I mean, it's just a good fit. It's a good fit for me, you know, and uh, I just, man, I'm fucking with it. You know what I mean? I'm fucking with it real tough. So that was the last thing that I got at the closet. Um, and then th this stuff here, I got at Windsor and before the tape cut off, I also was showing you guys this. I love this. I told you guys, I love this rose color. Oh my God, this fits me so good. And even without a bra, because like I said, these girls don't hang, you know what I mean? It probably looked like it because my shirt is big or whatever, but you know, I got the little swoop going, you know what I mean? I got the little swoop going, a little, you know, anyway. But, um, Windsor, a size medium, all the clearance was half off of whatever it's marked. Uh, and this is like that faux suede or whatever. And so, um, $23.87, half of that, um, was like 11 something or something to that, something to that effect. Is that not cute? I love it. And with some jeans or something. Killing it. And I love this top too. I got this from Windsor. And, oh, my God, I love this top, man. I love this fucking top. No, I got this from the closet. Okay. Clearance, $5.99 plus an extra 15% off for whatever reason. But when I put it on, it it, it, it it do what I needed to do. It lace up the back. Check up. Do you see that back, though? It laces all the way down the back. It laces down the back. Do you hear me? Yes, 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 yes. So that... Um, I got this lounger, uh, like a onesie jumpsuit, long though, like a little lounger, something that, you know, we're just kicking it or whatever we, you know, just kicking it. And, you know, but I still want to be, I still want to be covered up, but still giving baby body, um, you know, no, no, no panties, no bra, just giving it to him like that. Look at the back. And he got the little lace going on. It got the swoop in the back, and it's very, 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 very long. And this is a size medium, and it was on clearance for $9.95. And oh my God, oh my God, I love this. And it just looks so cute on. It's just it's just one of them that you're just kicking it around the house. You know, you're just kicking it with your dude, and you know, y'all watching movies or whatever, and you're just kicking it, but you want something sexy and cute, and you want to smell good and be fluffy and soft. And all that kind of stuff. And you want them up under you, but you don't want to be naked. One of these right here. And then therefore, he can still slide something to the side if he need to. You know what I mean? One of them. Um, anyway, so I goes to Dee Dee's because I was like, you know, I want to really get, you know, I'm still, you know, on the hunt for some jeans. Now, mind you, I have a whole stack of jeans right here. I have so many jeans now that it's just pathetic. But I love jeans, and but I love a good fitting jean. I don't like my jeans to sag. I don't want them sagging in the crotch. I want a little slight camel toe going. I want you to be able to see the gap and all that. See that these thighs don't touch together. I'm going to need mine to fit me. Let me just go and say that. I need my jeans to fit me. And 
I got these from Didi's. They're size 11. So I that's this is this, this is the size that I wear now. I wear a size 28. Um, if 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 the numbers are like that, or if I'm like going to Didi's or whatever, I wear a size 11. And these pants fit me like a glove. Oh my God, the way they're made. Oh my God, and they're Paris blues denim. Oh my God, for curvy girls, got a little, you know what I'm saying, a little hip on it, a little thigh on it, a little butt on it. Bang, bang. Look at the back of the jeans and the way the jeans is made. You could tell that they're giving you curvature. You know what I mean? And look at the front. Oh my God. Oh my God. And I got them for $13.99. So I got two pair. I got these ones. And I got these ones. Size 11. <laughs> How about that for them apples? Paris Blues, yeah. These, these, mm-hmm, they get the job done. Do you understand me? They get the job done. So what I, um, what I plan on wearing a lot of, and that's comfortable for me, and especially like with my little body suits and stuff, is jeans. Jeans. I'm going to wear a lot of jeans. I love jeans. I love jeans now. I didn't love jeans at first, but I love jeans now because I don't have to worry about, you know, my stomach pouring over or, you know, tuck my shirt, my stomach more in the in the jeans so that therefore it ain't overlapping where the belt loops and all that shit is at. I want you to still be able to see my belt. And there was a time that, I, you know, I was doing all kind of tricks to make sure my stomach was tucked in my pants to where, as you know, you still seen, you know, what you need to see in the front. But, you know, now I'm, you know, I kind of graduated to where it's now I can wear whatever I want to wear. There's no restrictions on what I put on now. And it is just, it's just a whole different ball game. It's, look, let me show y'all this stack of jeans right quick. Let me show y'all this stack of jeans right quick. You think I'm bullshit. Hold on. I got a stack of jeans right here. <clears throat> And um, these are just some jeans that I had just pulled out of my drawer. And um, and I was just trying to figure out which jeans I, I was going to put on. And so I just had them sitting over there. And these are um, my Lucky Brand shorts. And these are actually too big, though. These are size um, 14s. They're 32s, but they're so big on me now. Oh, my God. These, pink, these, these, these shorts fit me, like, big. Like, almost to the point where it's... I can uh, I can have them button and I can slide them off like that, okay? I can I can pull them on and off just about with them buttoned up in their size 1432s. But I love them. It's my daughter. Hey baby. Okay. All right, I'm on my way right now. All right, I'll be there in a few minutes. Look for me. All right, baby. All right, bye, Nugget. Okay, so tomorrow, Taste the Soul. You guys, it's free. It's going to be off the chain. Come through, holla at your partner. Um, and I'm just going to be there to come out there and come hang out for a little while. Um, let the kids have their little company and stuff like that. Some of my son's friends are coming over and, you know, and they just, they're just going to kick around. They're going to grill and, you know, they, they just kicking it. And so while they doing that, my oldest son, put it that way. And, um, and I think my, I think third's friend, two of his friends are going to stay tonight. Um, my daughter, she has to work all weekend. So she was like, mom, I'm, I'm not thinking about them. So she's, you know, she got to work. So. Um, and mommy gonna go and have some, mommy gonna go and have some mommy time and gonna do some mommy things, you know, and, um, have some grown up time, you know, and, uh, so that's what, I, that's my plan. That's my plan for the weekend. And then I'm going to get, come back home. I'm not going to stay tonight <laughs> down there. I got to come home. I'm coming home to come, you know, and get, you know, because I need to see what these guys got going on. You know what I mean? You're not going to be parlaying and posting up and partying in the pad, and I need to be seeing what's going on, you know. Even though my son will be 20 um, on the 1st, and then my baby will be 15 on the 6th, but still, you know, I, they, it needs to be known that mama's around and mama's seeing what's going on. You know what I mean? So, 
um, I'm going to come back and uh, I'm going to go get me some Goldenberg first. And then I'm going to come back and I'm going to get comfortable and I'm going to watch um, uh, Michelle's movie. And um, so that's my plan. And um, I am going to get back to regular schedule program. And again, I just kind of got away a little bit because I had some good stuff going on that I couldn't really, you know, talk about. You know what I mean? And it was like, man, you know, I talk too much, you know, and, I, and I'm getting told too many times, Tina, you talking too much, you talking too much, shut up sometimes, you telling too much, you get, you know what I'm saying? And it's like, man, you know, it's, it's just crazy, you know, so I, I, I do that, you know, and then after this Kim Kardashian scare, wasn't that crazy? Oh my God, I just, you know, and it's like so many people hate her so badly, it's like people were just so, you know, so malicious and grinning and snickering because this happened to this lady i mean that's 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 horrible you know i've been robbed by gunpoint gun up to the head and all that and it is no joke it's no laughing matter it's not funny um it scars you it really really that's why i'm gonna tell you that's one reason why you know i had to get cameras all around my all around my house because in case something go down, they're going to catch your ass. Because one of these motherfucking cameras is going to... I no longer have a fear of death or anything like that. I just want them to catch the motherfucker that did it. That's that's it. That's it. Just catch the motherfucker that did it. Now, my dogs is going to alert me that somebody's coming. That's going to give me enough time to get what I need to get. You know what I'm saying? Because if I get you, I'm going to have to lay you down. I'm going to stand my ground. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to wait for the police. I got all my paperwork. I'm going to sit there and I'm going to wait on them. But my dogs is going to alert me and let me know, okay, it's an intruder. Somebody's here. By the time you open up that door and that woo 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 and all that shit get to going on, okay, now I'm going to have to come in there and I'm going to have to do something. You know what I mean? Because it's like, okay, I don't got enough forewarning that somebody's here and somebody's trying to intrude on me. And it ain't no joke. I mean, that's that. I mean... You know, and for people to make a mockery of it and, oh, well, I think that, you know, I think it's, you know, she just trying to do this right here for ratings of the show. And I'm like, damn, I mean, she come, she don't get no credit for nothing. I mean, damn. You know, see, for me, you know, like I was telling Bay, I don't need that type of uh, exposure or that type of success or that type of celebrity or whatever. Because I like to go and do as I shall please to do. I want to still be able to go and do and do whatever like I've been doing. You know what I mean? And when it gets to a point where your safety and welfare, where people just hate you so badly, where motherfuckers is wi willing to, you know what I'm saying, take felony chances to really get at you, that's crazy. And it's not a laughing matter. It's no joke. It's not funny, you know? It's like there's so many people in this world that are without... There's so many people that are in this world that are hurting, malicious, mean-spirited. Oh, my God. I mean, the devil the devil is busy. Do you understand me? And misery loves company. You can't have good shit. You know, and that's why baby was like, stop, you know, just kind of pipe that down. I, baby, I know you happy and all that kind of stuff, but pipe that down because some of these chicks and some of these motherfucking niggas, you don't know. You know what I mean? You don't know what be on the mind of some of these motherfuckers. So, you know, I, I, I got it. I understand. <laughs> I got it and I understand. So, anyway, on that note, I wanted to show you guys some of my little goodies that I picked up. Um, I don't know if I had showed you guys these two. I had also got these from the Goodwill for $14.99, and I just like these two. They're just some shades. I don't know if I showed you guys these ones before, too. And then Marc Jacobs, but they're cute, and they're huge, and they're actually new. <laughs> yeah, and I got these for $14.99. So, you know, once again, it just has a lot to do with the donors. Um, and, and another thing, if it's for you, it's for you. That's just the way that it is. I don't give a damn what. If something is for you, it's going to wait for you to get there to come get it. Nobody, it's, not, it's not for nobody else. It's for you. So, you know, hell. And even at my Goodwill that I go to, hell, it's all kind of employees and all that other kind of shit, hell. Before they put that shit on the floor, they'd be like, nah, that right there, I'm buying that. You know what I mean? But for whatever reason, my things are just waiting for me to come get them. So what can I say? So on that note, let me go get my baby off from work right now, and um, I gotta get, figure out what's going, what I'm gonna do with this hair, how I'm gonna change this out. Um, I also need to taper those pants in, probably put some dark stuff in them to kind of bring them in a little bit, 
and um, I gotta put a load in the wash. I got some things to do. Um, I'm gonna be up for a good while, um, but I do plan on leaving early in the morning to get there, get you know, get parked and all that kind of stuff. And um, so, on that note, I see you guys tomorrow. I love you guys. Love you guys for watching, and you have an awesome weekend. And you gotta stay out the way. It's too much going on. Every day is something. You know what I'm saying? Rest in rest in peace to Tommy. Oh my God, that 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 just kind of fucked me up too. You know, from Martin show. I'm just like, oh my God, that just fucked me up. Joe sexy ass. Anyway, let me let me go. I, I gotta go. All right, family. Love you guys. Bye.